you know lot of youngsters you know they consume poison and this thing so let's say that a youngster has usne poison le liya aur wo mar gaya then what happens how does the process of medico legal kick in consider a situation which you said that some youngster or a person has consumed a poison the casualty medical officer or the doctor treating now has a body which doesn't have any life sometimes the smell may tell the doctor about what type of poison is consumed but police investigation will of course happen they will do a medico legal case they will take the body for post mortem the So doctor will call the police and hand over the body so what is the responsibility of a doctor in such cases is to hand over the body to police and do a medico legal case so that the police do further investigation hmm. so the police will take the body for post mortem and in the post mortem of course as i told you so many questions need to be answered for example what was the poison taken second is how much of the poison was consumed what time the poison was consumed and what was the effect of the poison on different organs in the body the police have to answer all this to find out whether it was really suicide or somebody else has given the poison mm-hmm. and then disappeared so that is why then in these cases the viscera is preserved it is sent to a forensic lab and the report sometimes takes 2 or 3 months to come because they run through all the different tests over 3 months yes 